Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. This is another swatch party video. Really quick, I do want to let you guys know if you want to see how I created this easy birthday slash New Year slash Christmas appropriate makeup look, I will go ahead and link it up in the cards. It's a collab with my dear friend Kara. We both have December birthdays, so we decided to collab and do a birthday makeup look. Anyway, I'm not going to keep going on about that, but this puppy came in the mail. I totally blame this on Angelica. Of course, I had heard about this palette, I think maybe from her Will I Bite series, and then she mentioned it again, and I was like, oh, these shades look so beautiful. And recently she did a haul video, and she said she had swatched these, and they swatched so beautifully, and I got mine, so let's go ahead and swatch this, because I know a lot of you are, oh my, curious about this company they are based in Germany the shipping was pretty quick you guys I believe it's like is it ten dollars to ship I don't remember but uh, I wanted to try it out and see I probably won't be buying too many indie brands from overseas next year but I wanted to give this a go god that blue is so pretty it kind of reminds me of Colourpop coconut the super shock shadow so that is the first row. I don't know if the shades have names. Actually, I bet they do. Duh, they sent me this card with the shade names. So I arranged it exactly how it is on this card. So the first four shades are Nymph, Ephemerum, I don't know how to say it, Cycle, and Equilibrium. And also, I should tell you guys, this is some of the prettiest single eyeshadow packaging I've ever seen. It has a little magnetic piece in here, so the shadow was magnetized to this little thing and it was slipped in this little envelope and just like the quality I obviously got 12 of these I did toss them but I just kept one to show you guys in the swatch party video that I will now toss because I am doing swatches but yeah I thought that was really great attention to detail I do wish you could kind of save some money by not getting the palette because I have so many Z palettes I could put this collection in but it's kind of cute, so I'm not going to complain. So these rust colors are like right up my alley for, as far as like in the crease, you know. So I'm always happy to have that like, you know, typical brown that I th I'm sure a lot of people think is super boring. But for me, it's like my favorite. <laughs> so there are the next four shades and we have um, Spawn Symbolism. Imago and Rebirth and this is called the Hive Collection I think like Beehive <laughs> like Beyonce <laughs> anyway and the last four this this these three green shadows are really like me oh my god I can't wait I literally cannot wait to play with this palette oh my god Okay, so there's the last four. I hope I'm doing this right, because I always fuck this up somehow. So there are the 12 shades from the Hive collection by Lethal Cosmetics. Like I said, they are based in Germany. Shipping was not bad at all, so if you guys have been contemplating picking this up, I would totally recommend it. I haven't tried it on my eyes yet, but I am expecting good things after swatching it. I'm so into the pops of green, you guys. I also started a green eyeshadow palette playlist, and I also finally started a pop of blue eyeshadow palette playlist, so we can keep track of all these crazy pop of blue releases. Anyway, I'm going to keep this short. Thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I will be doing a get ready with me with this lethal palette soon, as well as a review for you guys, so don't forget to subscribe so you can keep up. And I hope you guys are having an awesome holiday season. I will catch you in my next one soon. Bye, guys.